All right, welcome to the Ravid Show. We are here at Incota's No Limits uh, event, and I'm super excited to host uh, Ryan and Justin from Gate City Bank. Uh, uh, first of all, thanks for uh, you know talking to us. I'm kind of excited to obviously learn more about uh, you know the relationship that Gate City Bank has with Incota. Uh, but just for audience, would you like to quickly introduce yourself? Tell us uh, what you do at uh, Gate City Bank. Absolutely. My name is Justin Zach. I'm the Vice President of Business Intelligence at Gate City Bank. So I'm in charge of the application and the development of the anal analytics, analysis, reporting, and dashboarding at the bank. I'm Ryan Sather. I'm the Senior Data Engineer at Gate City Bank. Um, my responsibilities is pretty much all of the architecture, all of the orchestration, data quality, um, validation tests, all of that on a daily basis and making sure the data is just ready on time and correct. That's awesome. Uh, first of all, I uh, love the talk that you both did today at the event, and I have a few questions around it. I know, um, you know, the the initial challenges that you all mentioned about. So I have a question around that. Uh, can you describe the limitations you faced uh, with your Oracle platform and how it impacted your data processes? Sure, I can talk to that. So. With our local platform, there's always a, this inconsistency of the data being ready, the data being right. If there was an issue and something happened downstream, it would take us almost all day to find the problem. Mm -hmm. There was nothing that indicated you know, what it was, so we sp spent a lot of time just researching and trying to figure out what it was, and by that time, it was almost the end of the day, and the next day the data was gonna load anyway and fix it. So mm. you know, that was definitely one of the challenges. I'd love to add. Yeah. yeah. I'd love to add to that if I might. Um, that was a system that we inherited, and the the previous developers had put it together in a manner that was um, perhaps a little bit wild west. So we were um, uh, working with multiple reports that may intentionally tell the same story, but would wind up with different results. So mm -hmm. we would have questions about the integrity of the data, the accuracy of the data, and that led to a lot of problems with the business users. Okay, uh, those are great insights. So, uh, anything else? Just oh, that's okay, yeah, uh, so quickly also wanted to learn a little about the transformation journey. Uh, so, how has the implementation of InQuarter transformed Gate City into a data-driven organization? Can you share a little about that? Uh, absolutely, so InQuarter has allowed us to share data with uh, all of the team members at the bank from a teller all the way up to the president of the bank and we're able to perform calculations and insights that we simply weren't able to perform before. And one of the, the greatest benefits that we especially see is the ability to ingest data from so many different data sources, transform it in one single location and then provide the results in a unified cohesive manner. So when someone asks a question and they want to know what is the market share, they have one place to go for that answer. and that has changed the way um, people look at data at the bank, they trust it. And when you have trust in the data, you can really have a strong data culture. Thank you, thanks Justin. Ryan, anything? So also with Incord, we've, we've been able to quantify if there's any issues in the data, we can immediately see. We have a dashboard that says, if the customer data wasn't right, we know exactly where it was, we can see where it is and fix it very quickly, oftentimes before the customer even knows there was something wrong. Um, and also with regard to the, just the speed of with the data being ready and the reliability, our month-end process, for example, used to be <laughs> somewhere between you know 10 a.m. and 3 in the afternoon. Now it's all ready before 8 a.m. when everybody gets wow. there and there's no questions about Faster it. Faster the so, better, I feel. Yeah. It's always that case. Uh, also, to, since we're on this topic, I'm kind of also curious to know more about, uh, you know, uh, if you can uh, actually explain how having a 360 degree view of operations has benefited your executives overall business decisions uh, yeah just for our audience would love to know a little about that as well Absolutely. yeah just did well I don't want to speak necessarily for the executives I can tell you that they they do use the reporting that has been built uh, on a daily basis they receive uh, push reports and dashboards that are specific to their areas of operations and so they're able to really keep a pulse on their specific areas of operations whether it's IT marketing or uh, branch operations they're able to see uh, insights into the behaviors of the 
team members into the behaviors of the customers that they simply weren't able to see before. Mm. Okay, that's uh, something pretty interesting in terms of, you know, obviously the usage as well. That That is something what every company would want, uh, like even in Quota would want their platforms to be used by all the executives and the maximum utilization. Uh, quick question a little about the future as well. So would you like to share a little about uh, what plans uh, do you have in future for uh, leveraging in Quota to enhance your data culture and operations? And how do you see it uh, in general in the future? Well, with, without a doubt, we plan to use Encorda for the machine learning and the predictive analytics capabilities that it offers. We've spent the last couple of years um, getting the data ready to uh, be utilized for the predictive analytics uh, features. And, and this summit today has shown us, um, or it's really demonstrated some of the new features that are about to come out. It's very exciting for us. That's awesome. Uh, Ryan, anything that you would like to add? Fantastic. One last question for both of you. Uh, if folks want to reach out to you, learn more about uh, the enterprise world, learn more about Incota, or in general as well, which is the best place? Absolutely. You can reach me on at LinkedIn, Justin Zach. Uh, I'm the only one that gets it back. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, also on LinkedIn for me, Ryan Sather, um, Gate City Bank. Should be pretty easy to find me. So. Fantastic. Ryan, Justin, such a pleasure chatting with you. Thanks for uh, coming to the Robert Show and uh, loved your talk again. I'm pretty sure the audience, when we put it on demand, like the Encoda team would put it on demand, they would love it as well. Thank you very much. Thank you.